Welcome to Juniper Network's Contrail demo series. Today we are demonstrating network functions virtualization with the Contrail SDN controller. Telecom networks contain an increasing variety of special purpose hardware appliances. To launch a new network service often requires yet another appliance. Finding the space and power to accommodate these boxes is becoming increasingly difficult, in addition to the complexity of integrating and deploying these appliances in a network. Moreover, Hardware-based appliances rapidly reach end of life. Hardware life cycles are becoming shorter as innovation accelerates, reducing the return on investment of deploying new services and constraining innovation in an increasingly software-centric world. Network function virtualization evolves standard IT virtualization technology to consolidate many network equipment types onto industry standard high volume servers, switches, and storage. It involves implementing network functions and software that can run on compute hardware and that can be moved to or instantiated in various locations in the network as required. NFE brings substantial benefits to network operators and their customers, including the ability to provision and scale out services quickly and cost-effectively on existing infrastructure, enabling operators to better compete with over-the-top offerings, reduce time to market and improve return on investment on new services, reduce operator capital and operational expenses through reduced equipment costs and power consumption, and openness to virtual appliance market and pure software vendors for new innovation. NFV is highly complementary to SDN. Once network functions are virtualized, they can be dynamically chained in the required sequence by an SDN controller. Contrail exposes RESTful northbound APIs to cloud orchestration platforms or operational and business support platforms to receive service creation commands. It then spins up one or more virtual machines on standard servers running software images of relevant network functions. Contrail vRouter runs along with hypervisors on these servers and communicates with Contrail controller to dynamically set up overlay tunnels to route traffic between the designated networks through the newly created service. When demand for the service increases, Contrail can scale out the service to more virtual machine instances and load balance among them. Similarly, when the service demand comes down, Contrail can scale back on the number of service instances to conserve resources, achieving truly agile and elastic service provisioning. In this demo, we will show you a fictitious service provider called Fast and Furious, who leverages Contrail technology for NFV and offers a series of network services on demand from their online service store. In the back end, once the online service order is complete, a set of Contrail RESTful APIs are invoked to automatically provision the virtual services and provide dynamic service chaining. We will show this demo from the perspective of Mock Financial, a Fast and Furious customer with headquarters in Berlin and branch offices in London and Paris. Mock Financial currently receives their VPN service from Fast and Furious and internet services from another provider, but is unhappy with their often disrupted internet access. Here we can see that trying to browse any internet site from a host in Mock Financial's VPN results in a failure, and pinging a public DNS server is also unreachable, but the VPN service remains intact. In addition to VPN service, Fast and Furious has been offering internet over the top through NFV. Mock Financial decides to switch internet service providers in order to receive internet service from Fast and Furious's online service store. With a few simple clicks, the new internet service is activated and the corresponding compute and network resources are allocated, as can be verified through both the Contrail and OpenStack user interfaces. Now hosts in Mock Financial can browse external websites including external storage sites such as Dropbox and social network sites such as Facebook. They can also launch FTP to transfer files to external hosts. Life is good at Mock Financial until the IT department starts to suspect document leaks. With the Contrail analytics that Fast and Furious put together for their customers to monitor and troubleshoot overlay virtual network issues, Mock Financial IT can easily add a network analyzer to monitor traffic from internal to public networks. Here you can see that Contrail has spun up an analyzer virtual machine 
to monitor and tap into traffic destined for the internet. Now let's use the analyzer to do some packet capturing. As can be seen here, all the browsing, ping, and FTP activities are captured, and mock financial IT personnel can get a real-time view of what's happening in their over-the-top internet service. With this powerful tool, they identified that document leaks are due to external cloud storage, social networks, and file sharing through FTP. Based on the investigation, Mock Financial decides to order firewall service to restrict access to sharing protocols and social networks. Going back to the Fast and Furious service store, Mock Financial IT orders the firewall service online and verifies the firewall service instant based on Juniper's Firefly, was spun up and properly chained. The default policy is to restrict sharing protocols with social network sites. Once the Firefly service instant is activated, Mock Financial hosts can still access productivity sites such as Google, but access to Dropbox, Facebook, and FTP has been blocked. It is worth noting that this is a dedicated cloud-based firewall instance specifically for Mock Financial, which means that Mock Financial can be given access to manage the virtual services themselves. In this case, the management interface can be only reached through Mock Financial VPN and has an address of 12.3.0.252. When we log on to that address, we go directly to the Firefly Device Manager to configure policies based on business needs specific for Mock Financial. If for any reason Mock Financial decides to cancel any of these services, Fast and Furious offers them the capability to do it through the online store and deactivate the service immediately. Once Mock Financial cancels the firewall service, the firewall virtual instance is spun down and Mock Financial falls back to over-the-top internet service only. The compute and other resources associated with the firewall instance are released to the resource pool for reuse. Now access to the previously blocked sites is resumed. This concludes today's NFE and dynamic service chaining demonstration.